Hey, Andrew from Deity Microphones here. I've got Paul. Paul's a location sound mixer here in Los Angeles. Hey, Paul, can you show us different boom pole positions? Absolutely. I'm going to give you three different boom pole positions for all different situations. I like it. Let's do it. So what is number one? First one we're going to talk about is the classic two-hand overhead boom position that you've probably seen a hundred times and anytime you've ever seen a boom up. Over top, this is great for high camera angles, wide camera angles, or in this case, obstacles like these pool table lights. You have to get over them because underneath you'd be blasting shadows all over your scene. You can't have that. So over the top and remember, stay out of frame. Stay out of frame, watch your shadows. Cool, let's go to number two. What is our second boom position that we can do? Right, well, when we get tired of this overhead classic pose, we wanna drop it down, bring our forearm over the top of the boom. That way we have a little bit lower and we can give our arms a little bit of a rest from that overhead position. Yeah, that's pretty good. We can also reverse your hand and use it to lift up from the bottom of the boom pole. That way it gives your elbow a bit more of a rest too. And we can take this time to shake out those hands if we've been doing it for a long time. Yeah, awesome. Let's go take a look at number three, okay? Cool. What other positions can we boom in? Well, the third one we're gonna talk about is the underarm position. The boom goes under your arm and you support it from underneath like this. Okay. This serves two purposes. One, it gives you another different grip that you could break and rest your arms in. But the second purpose is now I have a free hand. So when I'm carrying my mixer, I have a free hand to manipulate any volume controls oh, wow. or settings or gain controls that I need to manipulate. Okay, I like that. Awesome, so we've got above our heads for nice big wides and kind of traditional kind of shoots. If we're doing long takes, we've got forearm and we can reverse that back and forth and stretch our fingers. Right. And we've got under the arm if we need to do gain settings and all that other kind of, of menu course. stuff and record with our mixer. That's awesome. Thank you so much, Paul. Oh, it's my pleasure. Cool, later man. And there you have it, three different ways you can hold your boom pole. Okay, follow us on all the social media platforms at DD Microphones. Leave a comment below and tell us what we should make our next video about. The best comment is going to win a DD shotgun microphone, and those are pretty good. I'm Andrew from DD Microphones. Remember, sound is half the picture.